Hi, hello, welcome back to my channel Geetika Tips and Timely Varieties. So today's class is about kitchen. Sir is going to explain about it. Okay. Now, for any house, kitchen is important place because we are going to cook our food and that food will help you to survive longer. So that's the reason why cook is a must be in an auspicious place and it should be in the right direction then only the people who are cooking will be happy and also make us to happily eat the food that is cooked by them. So for where should be the kitchen in any house or flat or independent house even even the office also you can have this kitchen where in the case of office you may be cooked tea or something else or the microwave will be placed. So I will be giving you some of the tips regarding the kitchen. So usually the kitchen should be in the southeast direction. Should be in southeast. Should be in southeast corner. Okay. So the kitchen must be in the southeast corner of the total building. So then what is the next one? Where should be you should have cooking top or gas? Gas or you can say stove. Okay. So that it will be easy for you. Gas stove or stove. Anything whatever you want to have, you can have gas stove or any other stove. Then that should be placed in the southeast, that is on the eastern side. Eastern side in southeast corner. In southeast corner, why I am specifying uh, so eastern side means southeast corner will have east and also south side. But the cooking stove, whatever it is, whether it is a electric stove or gas stove or an ordinary stove, that should be placed on the eastern side of the north southeast corner. That's most important. And the person who is cooking, let's say chef or huh? a woman who is cooking should face east while cooking. So the woman who is going to cook your food, your mother or wife should face east while cooking. Then only that is the correct place. Okay. Then where should you have sink? Sink must be in the northeast corner. Sink must be in the northeast corner of that particular room. So sink. So what for you are doing? You are using that sink for cleaning the utensils. So that's why you must have a sink in the northeast corner. And then one of the important thing is you are not supposed to have any weight in the northeast corner. That's the reason why every room northeast must be preferably don't keep anything. So even the kitchen, the sink should not touch the north wall. North wall. That's why you leave a gap of something, let's say 9 inches or 1 foot and then place your sink. Then you can have L-shaped platform for cooking and keeping you, uh, your utensils and everything. So that's most important. Then what are the things you are going to come across in the kitchen? Let's say micro oven. Micro oven can be placed in the southern side of that particular kitchen so that you can enjoy the cooking. Okay. So what else? You can have storage on the western side and also southern side or southwest corner. You can have number of shelves so that you can keep your utensils and items that can be stored in that particular place. So you should have one entrance from kitchen to outside to south, from southeast that is south of southeast you should have an exit from kitchen to other side that is most important these are the few tips you are supposed to follow in the kitchen then that housewife will be enjoying the life and then they will be cooking and enjoying the food while they are eating so these are the important tips when you consider to buy a house or to construct 
a house in the kitchen. So these are the things you are supposed to keep in mind when you are constructing. Okay, that is. Now, for example, you what else you have? If you have anything else, you can comment in the box so that I can tell you the remaining whatever the positions you want it. Okay. So let's say dishwasher. Dishwasher can be kept adjacent to the kitchen so that water can be exited exit from that particular place. So dishwasher can also be placed there. So that is. So these are. These are the few tips that should be known by any individual so that you will not commit any mistake while you are constructing the house. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you for explaining uh, about uh, kitchen where we have to keep our items, stove or which, fa uh, which phase we have to do our cooking also. Thank you for your tips. Hope everyone understood, understood our class today. First time who is watching my channel, please subscribe and then click on the bell icon for more interesting updates. Like, share and subscribe my channel. Thank you.